Hi everyone, my name is Lauren. I'm from Melbourne, Australia. I'm a makeup artist and beauty therapist. My Instagram followers have been very vocal about me doing some YouTube tutorials on the looks that I post. Um, I'm very nervous. This is my first video, so please forgive me if it's not fantastic, but I'm, I'm going to try and I hope I'll get better. So if you want to learn how to do a bronzed smoky eye, stick around and let's have some fun. So I'm going to put the NYX eye base on. This one's just the nude colour. brush it's a 9s and what brush so it's like a little flat cute little brush I'm going to use this with the color number nine so it's this one yeah that one there it's like a nice bronze color this is going to go on the lid closest to the tear duct and sort of halfway I'm going to grab my Inglot brush uh, number 10S. This is a little blending brush that's really great for inside the crease. And I'm going to use the colour 609, and it's this one here. It's a nice sort of reddish brown with a bit of gold glitter in, in through it. So I'm going to take some of that and pop that in the crease in the crease and sort of bringing it down as well like a triangle shape and my blending brush this is one of my favorite this is an ingot brush again um, 7FS and it's an angled blending brush it's quite cool so you can sort of put it in the socket and blend the top colour and the socket colour together and it does a really good job. So I'm just going to blend that colour now, so that reddish brown. Alright, so I do want to make it a smoky, which means I do need to make it a little bit darker on the outside. I want to use a black. I'm going to use a matte black. The matte black I'm going to use is number 391 um, Inglot colour. Surprise, surprise. And I'm going to use that same little brush that I used before for the socket again. And in the socket, I'm not going to take it too far in, I'm just going to keep it in the corner. Just so we get that really nice gradient, light to dark, smoky eye. Where is it? Six oh five. So that one there. It's like a reddish copper. It's quite nice. I'm going to use that as a colour to blend the socket and the highlight, so it's not too stark. It sort of blends. So that's just going to go here, just in that place there. I'm going to just grab a little bit of that highlighter number 30 again, just to make it a little bit more crisp. And blend. some gel eyeliner. I like to use my absolute favourite is the Inglot AMC gel liner number 77. It's a matte black. It's the best in my eyes. So this one here I'm going to use with an angle brush like so. And this is number 31T Inglot. Little tiny teeny one. 
So this one I'm going to use to do the top of my lid and to create a wing and also an inside of my eye in a waterline. So grab a little bit of that and then start to line the top. Inglot Liner. It's the AMC Iron Lip Pencil Crayon, number 89. It's just a plaque, basically. And I'm gonna line under my eye here. Use the MAC Zoom Lash, so it's this one here. Oops. these lashes here. Now these have already been measured and cut because I've worn them before. So you only need a tiny bit of glue. If you put too much it's going to be too runny. You want to let it sort of get tacky. So let it dry for about 20-30 seconds. I'm using these tweezers today. They're so funky. I do need the mirror for this so I apologise if my face is too close to your face. I hope you enjoyed it and learnt something. So again, sorry if I made a fool of myself and um, the video wasn't that good. I hope you enjoyed it anyway. And yes, feedback would be really great. I really appreciate your comments um, and hopefully I can learn to make the videos a little bit better for you guys. Don't forget to follow my Instagram, ebony underscore maze underscore makeup. Uh, I'll put the link down below and like and subscribe. See ya.